Hey everybody, good morning. I'm Dwayne Marino. Welcome to Autoversity. If you like these tips, please hit share, subscribe, like, and comment. And today's tip uh, goes out by special request to somebody with the same initials as mine, DM, down in California. Uh, messaged me last night looking for a uh, short video on common sense. This actually was a tough one to do because common sense is supposed to be common sense, but as we know, common sense is just not common. So I think it's not only not common, I think it's gotten a little bit, um, I don't know, out of vogue is maybe how I'd like to put it. And here's my reasons for thinking that. There's a couple sentences I'll use in my training seminars and I can see a lot of people, actually most people have never heard of them. Uh, one is measure twice and cut once. Uh, that's an old saying from carpentry. Basically, once you cut the wood, you can't put the wood back on. So measure twice, cut once, has to do with you know due diligence, be careful, that kind of thing. Uh, another one is an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. Nobody's ever heard of that anymore. Uh, it's easier to prevent something from going wrong and that's true in life and health and um, finances or anything else than it is to fix something once it's broken. I think that makes kind of sense. Uh, let's uh, revisit some common sense stuff. Customer service, there is a novel idea, customer service. Well, if you don't service a customer, you won't have any um, uh, customers to service and no business. So isn't customer service really common sense? I can't believe that has to be taught or trained. Uh, follow up your client, um, uh, you know, uh, do as requested, open the door, um, call back, uh, this, this stuff is common sense. Um, here's your weight loss program. Move more, eat less, move more, eat less. Like, do you really need a weight coach to teach you that? Move more, eat less, that's common sense. Uh, live within your means, I think that's kind of common sense. Uh, do unto others as you want them to do under, unto you, that's common sense. I like, call it the golden rule, that's common sense. What goes around comes around, just treat other people and your customers like you'd want to be treated. So if you have common sense, this video is kind of probably a little redundant and maybe funny, because you're going, yeah, I know all this, I, I live that way. I hate to say this, if you don't have common sense, what I just said maybe just went right over your head or in one ear or out the other, because you need common sense to recognize what common sense is. So I don't know if it comes down to life experiences, how you were raised, I, have, I don't think it has anything to do with how smart you are, or IQ, I've seen a lot of smart people that have absolutely no, no common sense at all. Matter of fact, some really intelligent people have no common sense whatsoever. So anyways, I leave this with you. Um, uh, common sense is not common. If you have it, lucky you. If you don't have it, work on it. Expose yourself to a lot of different uh, things and watch what other people do and how they behave um, that don't get into maybe as many problems as you or people that you perceive to be lucky just might have a lot of common sense in their day in and day out dealings with people. I'm Dwayne. Hope everybody enjoyed that. We'll see you soon.